Have you ever stayed up after dark and spent some time looking at the night sky? If yes, then have you ever wondered why the sky looks dark at night? Last week, I asked my classmates this same question, and their answers were the same. Planet Earth rotates on its axis every 24 hours. One side is facing the sun, while the other one is not. If you're standing on the dim side, the sky looks dark to you. Simple, right? But the only reason the sky looks blue in the morning is because sunlight is being scattered off by molecules of nitrogen in our atmosphere. If our planet didn't have an atmosphere, the sky would always look dark, even if your side of the Earth is facing the sun. I'm asking, what's the secret behind the sky's darkness? This question was first asked by German astronomer Heinrich Wilhelm Olbers in 1823. This became known as Olbers' Paradox, and it says that if the universe is infinitely old, static, and it contains an infinite number of stars, then why isn't the sky blindingly bright night and day? I mean, you would spot a star no matter which direction you look, so why isn't it the case? In 1929, Edwin Hubble solved the paradox when he made a huge discovery. The universe is expanding. Before the 20th century, astronomers thought the universe always existed, always will. But it turns out, it has an edge, an edge of time. The universe began 13.8 billion years ago since the Big Bang. It was all crammed into an infinitely hot, dense blob and has been expanding ever since with stars and galaxies rushing away from us. How about I tell you about something very interesting. We all know that the speed of light is fast, 300,000 kilometers per second. But it's not infinitely fast. For example, light takes 4,300 years to reach us from Proxima Centauri, the closest star to Earth apart from the Sun. Now, imagine if it were the case for a much distant star. Light would take so much more time to reach us. In fact, in this moment as you're watching, light is making its way to us. Cool, right? There we go. Some of the stars and galaxies that are required to light up the night sky are so far away that light from them hasn't had time to reach us yet, which explains why the sky looks dark at night. Today, we learned the reasons behind the sky's darkness and how one of the simplest questions led to one of the most world-changing discoveries.